meme for the original creators thousands of years ago. Who were they? Were they aliens? Probably. Da, da, da. <laughs> frozen waterfall <laughs> and now <laughs> he's climbing it
Okay. I'm obsessed. Look at look at how pretty this color is. Yeah, look at that color. It's so dainty. I'm looking in the viewfinder because that's where I can see the color and whether I can tell whether or not I'm in focus or not. Um, I don't know. It's a sunny day today. It keeps alternating between super cloudy and snowy and ridiculously sunny and apparently today is supposed to be a very very sunny day and then we're gonna get a lot of snow so I'm taking advantage of it. And on these sunny days I like to have a nice cold drink and when your nails are a beautiful beautiful green the nice cold drink we make is a matcha latte. Let's let's go. We're feeling particularly shiny today. For those of you who know me, probably know I'm a little bit skincare obsessed. Um, I've tried a lot of things, but I'm finally actually down to a really good place with my skincare regimen, and I'm not adding or changing anything to that uh, product-wise. But there is something I've been wanting to try for a while that I finally got, and it's a gua sha. And oh, it matches my nails. Oh, that's so exciting. <laughs> oh, this is the green video now. It's, but in the spirit of this channel that I'm doing that you're watching right now, I'm taking you along with all the things that I do to pass the time. So that's what we're going to do right now. And you get to be a part of it huge honor I know I am going to be following an instructional video as I do it um, I'm gonna be following Gothamista's video on it um, she is a skincare youtuber and she's one of my favorites she always has such good information and she's just so soothing and calming I'll put a link in the description if you're interested in checking her out because she's so great so I'm probably gonna like speed it up so you don't see have to sit here for the whole 11 minutes but um that's what we're gonna be doing okay so my hands and face are clean and there's only a couple more things we need to do oh that's that's sexy there's only a couple more things i need to do before we get started first um i'm gonna take this little baby and i'm going to disinfect it luckily because we are in a panorama, I have this giant jug of alcohol, always on hand. And the second thing I need to do is put on some facial oil. So I don't usually use a lot of facial oil because, I don't know, I'm, I'm a sensitive gal. I am often scared that it's going to break me out because it has many times, but if I really don't like this afterwards, I can wash it off. It's 
it's really just gonna help <clears throat> the tool like glide and do its job. I wanna get my face nice and lubed up, you know? Mmm. With that beautiful glistening content that you wanted today, isn't it? looks if my skin looks any different if it looks drained if it looks relaxed um I look shiny and I probably look a little bit pink because I've just been rubbing my face with a rock but um that was really that felt really good so I'm gonna keep doing that and see if it actually makes a difference I mean plenty of people say that it does make a difference so it's not like I'm like out here investigative journalism but um for me let's see if I can commit to this pretty green rock. This is so much more of my face than you ever wanted to see. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay, so I was washing uh, the gua sha and I was like, where am I gonna put this? I wanna keep it safe so that it doesn't get like dusty. And then I remembered I have these beautiful little um, canisters. A few years ago, I got a whole bunch of them to put tea in, but I had way more than I need. Um, they come in all different like floral patterns, but they just, just wait I can do this so I'm going to wash it out make sure it's super duper clean and then I can store my little my little green baby in here First thing I did was add some seeds to the clean jar, put the lid on, give it a rinse, and then fill it up so that the seeds can soak. It says four to eight hours, so I just left it overnight. Good morning, good morning, good morning. So my seeds have been a soaking overnight, so I'm just gonna give them a drain. And then it says to invert them at an angle. Okay, it also has these, it has these feet so that you can just leave it like that. But all the tips online and the instructions on this say to invert it at an angle. So I'm gonna do this. Sounds good. Good 
morning. I know the lighting in here always looks the same and you can't tell the difference, but it's morning, I swear. So, I'm gonna be... Oh, they're starting to sprout. I don't know if you can see, but there's just a few little, little white sprouts coming out. It is Saturday morning. I started these on Wednesday night and they're already starting to sprout. Sunday morning. I'm very excited. I think I get to eat some of these today. Okay, so I actually waited another day because I wanted to see how much more they would grow and now this jar is jam freaking packed. So I'm gonna have some with a little bit of leftover sushi that I ordered yesterday because I was feeling like a bougie bitch. love how these seeds look. I think they look like really pretty rocks. Here's how the sprouts turned out and so with the little ones you just eat them whole but these ones have still really big seeds. Are you supposed to pull them off? Somebody tell me please. I am so overwhelmed right now. First of all as you can see I'm wearing <laughs> Andy got me the Taylor Swift cardigan cardigan, which is just uh, everything. You do stars around my scars and now I'm bleeding. But then also, I just got like a be delayed Christmas gift um, from his mom. <sighs> it's so beautiful. For those of you who don't know, I released um, an EP back in the fall for the first time with like my all my own music that I did all myself and ah, I love it. I love it so much. And she sent a frame too, so that gets to go on my wall. Okay, okay. 